CBX351 is an interesting compound. It is a fixed molar ratio of donorubicin and cytarabine that's encapsulated in a liposome. And so that delivers the drug uh, with an optimized uh, ratio of aracin and, and donorubicin uh, to the leukemic cells. And it's thought by that mechanism that it should have enhanced activity. Uh, it looks that this was the case from preclinical studies. Um, and that translated into a tolerable regimen that was tested in randomized phase two studies and actually seemed to show selective uh, efficacy amongst patients with secondary AMLs and for that reason that group was chosen for study in the phase three setting. Uh, the abstract that was presented by uh, Dr. Lancet uh, just yesterday was very exciting because uh, it's been very difficult to improve the survival of older patients with AML and specifically patients with high risk uh, AML in the elderly. And this study really homed in on that population specifically to say, can we improve their outcome? And indeed, they were successful in doing so. There was a statistically significant improvement in overall survival uh, using CPX351 uh, as compared to standard 7 and 3 donorubicin RSC at appropriate dosing for that population. Um, I think everybody was very excited by the results from this study.